What's up everyone? Today we have a 30 minute full body dumbbell strength workout. Today we'll be using two 10 pound dumbbells, but please use whatever weight suit you best. We'll have a two minute warm up, 30 seconds per move. Then for our workout, we'll have 45 seconds on and 15 seconds rest, followed by a three minute cool down. We'll have both standing and floor exercises. This routine is strength based with no jumping. However, we're still gonna get our hearts pumping today. So grab your mat, Grab your weights and let's get started. I told you every single time, don't you worry. You would always call me at the wrong time. All right, let's get started with our warm up. Let's reach up, side bend, center, and down. Here we go. Alternating sides. Good. Use your breath. Okay, we have squat, knee drive. Take those feet wide. We have toe reaches, then two cross reaches. Good, dynamic stretch through those hamstrings here. Come to one edge of your mat. You're gonna walk out into a plank, find it, and then come back. All right, I hope you're feeling nice and warm. Let's grab one dumbbell. We have alternating reverse lunges. Press forward, press forward. Here we go. All right, dumbbell in the right hand. We have squat down and overhead press. Squat thrusters. Here we go. Nice, inhale to lower. Exhale to press, hold that core strong, ribs down and in. All right, take a breather. You're gonna switch it into your left hand.
Let's do it. Pick up your other dumbbell. Whew. Next up, bicep circles. So start wide, take it up and over, in, up and over, out. Here we go. So you're curling about three quarters of the way up. So you keep that activation as we circle it up and over. All right, feet are about hip width. We have suitcase squat, hammer curl, palms in. Here we go. Break those legs, work the biceps. All right, ditch one dumbbell, come onto the floor, on two hands and knees. Dumbbell is in the right hand. We have three tricep extensions and three underhand rows. Here we go. Good, so you're rotating that wrist as you transition between the rows and the tricep extensions. Rotate, good. All right, same thing. We're gonna do the left hand this time. Here we go. Good, keep that elbow back for the tricep extensions. Really squeeze. Okay, come on to your back, grab both dumbbells. You're gonna lift those hips into a bridge, wide fly, then dumbbells together, narrow press, lower the hips, 
bring it back up. Here we go, join in. Good, if you do wanna modify, you can just keep those hips down. Just focus on the upper body. Good, slight bend through those elbows for the fly. Good, squeeze through the center chest for the narrow press. Nice, press through those heels. Engage those glutes at the top. All right, next up, we have a press with a crunch. Your hands are about shoulder width this time, palms facing in. Here we go. Inhale, exhale, crunch up, work the core. Ditch one dumbbell. You're gonna lean back for a mason twist. Twist to one side, twist to the other side. Here we go, leaning back, shoulders down and back as well. Good, twist through those core muscles. Good, almost there. Keep leaning back. You got it. Right back onto all fours. The dumbbell is coming underneath the right knee. To modify, you can do it without the dumbbell. We have donkey kickbacks. With that added challenge of the weight. Good, if you are doing it without a weight, but still want a challenge, you can always do pulses. Okay, switch sides. Dumbbell is coming underneath that left knee for this next round. Let's do it. Work into those glutes and into hamstrings as well. Good, pull that core in. All right, stand on up, grabbing both weights. We have overhead press, single, single, and little pulse back with those elbows. 
Here we go. Exhale. Inhale. Since you walked through the door, I've been trying to reach you. Cause I feel you. What's the story to tell? What's the story behind? The mountain you're trying to climb. Think I've heard it before in a movie line. We can Good elbows stay lifted. Feel the burn through those shoulders. Okay, deadlift, slight bend through those knees, keep the dumbbells close to you, then two lateral shoulder raises. Good, keep those elbows supported, don't let them droop, and we do those raises to the side. Good, you can have a bend through those elbows if you need to. Okay, your right leg lunges back. We have three little pulses. Then side lunge out. Repeat, just on that same side. Here we go, right leg back. Three pulses. All right, same thing, other side. Left leg steps back, pulse, two, three, really pull up tall, and dumbbells on either side of that leg for the side lunge. Okay, next up we have wide curls, palms facing up. Three with one knee up, then three with the other knee up. To modify, you can always just stand feet hip width. Let's add in that challenge for your balance. Here we go. Next up, bend those, those knees, lean forward. We have two punches down, then bent arm, wide fly. It's 
Starting with elbows back. We have two rows. Good, work the back of the shoulders for that fly. And into the back muscles for those rows. Nice and flat back. Really control this movement. Next up, staggered squat. We're gonna do three on one side. Step one foot slightly back. Staggered squat three times. Then the other side. Teeniest step back to make it staggered. Here we go. Good, back heel is lifted. You've got it, send those hips back. Good, don't forget to switch after three reps. Show it to you from the side. Got a feeling that I let you slip away. And maybe I can say this. How could I be so stupid? Yeah, I feel so useless. You ditch one dumbbell. Dumbbell comes into the right hand here. We have tricep extension, bend, and press. Here we go. You can do it without the support of that other arm, or you can support that elbow. Up to you. Switch into the left arm. Let's do it again. I promise I'll try. Uh, Here we go again with or without that support. As long as you're keeping that elbow in place for the tricep extension. Good. Don't let it move. Don't let it splay out to the side. Core is strong and activate it. Okay, we have squat, reach down, twist knee, alternating sides. Here we go. Let's get that heart rate up for the last few moves here. Good. Next up, alternating curtsy lunges. You're gonna raise the arms forward, step together, other leg to intensify, lift the arms all the way overhead. 
Here we go. Good, I'm gonna intensify full range of motion. Good, body stays upright. Good, work into the legs and the shoulders. Good, you're so close to the end of this workout. Almost there. Okay, this is the hardest move yet. You have the option to modify if needed. Drop the dumbbells. Step out, tricep push-up, step in, stand. Here we go, you can do it without dumbbells or you can stick with just tricep push-ups if needed. Good, elbows graze past the side body here. Make sure you're keeping that flat line for the plank. Engage the core. Take a breather. Ooh, flip around. Lean back alternating bicep curls. Whew. Okay, push through. Let's do it. Good, keep that lean back. We're still working the core and the biceps at the same time. Good, you're so close. We're just gonna finish off with some core work after this. Ditch one dumbbell. Ooh. Okay, you're gonna do a reverse crunch. So lift the hips, then extend to modify. Just top the toes down instead. Here we go, lift those hips with control. Good, keep that low back attached to the floor when we extend those legs out. Okay, we're gonna do overhead pullover, then double crunch here. Good, bent elbows, lift head, neck, and shoulders. Good, see if you can lift off even more, reach even higher. Okay, final move, flip around. Find a low plank, your dumbbell is in front of you here. We're gonna reach for that dumbbell and do little taps. You can always modify by just holding plank or dropping the knees. 
Let's do it. This is your final move. So push through. Good, challenge yourself here. You got it. See if you can avoid rocking those hips from side to side as much as you can. Oh, we have a cool down. Okay, we have child's pose. I nearly forgot. Rest here, open up those knees wide. Drop the forehead to the floor. Lunge forward with the right leg. Reach overhead, slight back bend. Good. Hands on your leg. Sink those hips. Good. Pull that belly away from the front leg as much as you can. Get a little bit more of a stretch in the hip flexor. Switch legs, left leg forward. Reach overhead, little back bend, open the chest. Good. Hands on your leg here. Okay, sit on your bum, extend the legs, forward fold. Be what you are, like what you feel. Don't let the colors fade when it's hard to deal. So pick up the dice, give it a roll. Get yourself up when you lift out alone. We think we know it all. Finish off laying on your back, arms wide in T position. Let the knees fall to the right, gaze comes to the left. Good, twist through the spine, breathe it out. And switch sides. Knees come to the left. All right, bring those knees into the center. Give them a little squeeze. And now you're done. Amazing work. Okay, team, amazing work today. I'm super proud of you for making it to the end of the workout. Also, please let me know if you enjoy having the warm up and cool down included in these longer workouts by commenting below. If you felt the burn, then hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in the next one.